because I try to keep things like an open book. Like I talk about my addiction. I talk about relationships. I, I don't go into names specifically. You know, I, I keep it tasteful. I don't want to get anything that too personal and involves someone else without their blessing. But as far as my take on things and what I've been through without getting too specific name wise, like and anything goes. That's something that gets I get asked a fair amount. People will ask me like, "Do you feel comfortable talking about that about addiction or something?" And I, I enjoy talking about that. Like I want, you know, I feel like I can help people, and I know I have. I've written songs about addiction, and I've talked with people at shows, and I know of several people over the years that have quit drinking or quit doing drugs, and I've helped them to do that. And that's like, that's something that I feel awesome to be able to do, and I want to continue to do. Like I'm actually gonna I plan on writing a book at some point from kind of a agnostic, atheist, non-religious, non-religious rock and roll guy that's gone through addiction and got his shit together. Like you can do this with or without a NA or AA and how to approach it if you're not into the God speak, how you can go to AA and not have it drive you nuts. Like I feel like I have a perspective that needs to be shared, you know, because most books you see like that, it's the classic rock and roll drugs, drug dude, they become a total born again Christian and it's, it's a religious thing and it puts a lot of people off. And I could, same story, same thing. I went to AA too, but I'm not, I didn't find God. You don't have to do that either, you know?